Hey guys, what's going on? Hey, Jokers. Happy Friday, y'all. Feel me with just a little more Jesus Friday. I made it. Made it in one piece by the grace of God, y'all. I did. So, we got a little small haul for the weekend. Um, picked up a few things for us to eat. Um, I actually sat down and read Galen's doctor's papers from when he was released from the emergency room. And so, he's been up walking around on it. Now, me, I was like, baby, I don't think you should let it get stiff. Well, I was telling him wrong. He's supposed to keep it stabilized because he's he said it's starting to frustrate him that it's not getting better. I guess he's being impatient. Um, it's not hurting as bad as it was, but he can't bend it. His papers say he's not supposed to. So it, it says it takes up to six weeks in order for it to heal. And I'm like, oh, my word. They put him off for nine days. So, yeah, we got to see can we get an earlier appointment for him to go in to see the doctor. Look at this. And we'll just go from there. So, I bought a knee brace and they put one on so we took it back thinking we didn't need it. Because she said the one that she was going to put on would do better. It will relieve the pain. So, we're going to see. But anyway, um, I'm, let me show y'all what I picked up. Tonight, we're going to have we're going to make sub sandwiches. So I got four loaves of bread from Walmart. And here's the other one. Okay. Four loaves of bread. And this is the French bread. I got some apple juice that they've already popped open. I got Corey two things of Capri Suns. He has, I think, two things of the high seat left. Um, he wanted some crackers. And he's already popped these open. Um, I picked up some salami for our sandwiches tonight. I already have roast beef. I have um, the black forest ham. And I think I have smoked turkey in the refrigerator already. I picked up some more mushrooms. And I got these two, which I will do a dinner for him tomorrow with sauteed mushrooms, spinach, and... I got my chicken um, in the little container right here. I'm getting ready to season that to go with this. Um, I have some drumsticks that he picked up for Corey. Tomorrow we're going to have um, the kids. We're going to have pizza and wings for them tomorrow. So the pizza that I'm going to pick up, I don't know if I'm going to do Little Caesars pizza or the Walmart pizzas, um, which is in near the deli section fresh pieces you have to cook them yourself when i tell you those things are good the the all meat oh, that thing is so good so we're gonna have wings and um pizza tomorrow for them um i picked up some cheese i have the fiesta blend these are my favorites y'all the fiesta blend is the monterey jack cheddar queso and queso queso dealer and asadero cheese is what it says this one is the italian cheese um mozzarella smoked provolone parmesan romano fontina and asiago this one is if i could keep me a case of that and the triple cheddar i, I buy these all the time my favorite cheeses I picked up two bags of pink salmon uh, the skinless pink salmon and these were four dollars at Walmart and you get a pound which I don't know how many fillets you get in one it's probably about maybe five so I got two of those for dinner one night I picked up the cherries they had the cherries in Walmart so I got a bag of those Galen and I like to slack snack on those I have some whipping cream where I'm going to make um, chicken, spinach, that dish for, for, I don't know if I should, well, yeah, a chicken dish with the spinach, mushrooms, and heavy whipping cream. 
I got a gallon of milk. I picked up a bag of the um, California blend vegetables. I have one bag of broccoli left. And um, I have a bag of the one with the peppers and the wax beans and green beans in it. So that'll give us at least two or three days of vegetables. Um, I have two whole chickens that I am either going to bake in the oven with probably roasted potatoes or something like that or either make chicken casserole. I know they're going to be rooting for the chicken casserole. Um, last but not least, I have some tilapia. I know what it says about tilapia, y'all, but I like tilapia. I'm going to say a prayer over my food. Do you hear me? I got the um, skinless and boneless, and then we got some whole tilapia, okay? So I got these for the kids so they don't have to fight with the bones, and I got three um, whole fish in here. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. I got a cake I'm getting ready to make. Um, and wash a few dishes and then that's going to be it y'all I just wanted to come and share with you guys what I will meal plan for the next let me see maybe 4 or 5 days will look like I still have my beef short ribs in the refrigerator well in the freezer um, I still have my my bean burgers that I need to eat so I'll probably do those um I might try one of those tonight myself and let the kids eat the sandwiches. I don't know. Um, so we probably won't need to pick up any food, food, food like this until maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. And, um, yeah, because I think I have enough stuff that we can have sandwiches. One, oh, I can also, we're going to have, I have Jack Mackerel and Grits for one day. Um. Yeah, I got enough to make. If I change my mind on something, I will. Um, I got sausages where I can do sausage, tomatoes, and rice. And add um, salsa and tomatoes. And I'm thinking about getting a can of corn and add some corn to it. Uh, what else can I make? Um, hmm. um, some chicken. I may have to get another bag of chicken. I don't know. I may... I'll figure it out. Um, I don't think I'm going to use all of that. So it'll probably be half of that bag of chicken. I can do another chicken dish. And I've got my quinoa. Thank you, Miss Punkin. She sent me a recipe when I mentioned I wanted to find a recipe to do with quinoa. And she sent me one that I could do. So I'm going to look and see if I have all the ingredients for that. And... Yeah, so just want to give y'all, I don't meal plan, but but then I do. You know, I don't sit out and write it, but when I'm in the store, whatever meats I pick up according to my budget. So my budget today was $100 total. I didn't spend $100. I spent um, 80 no, $90 and some change is what I spent. But um, I don't know if anybody else do this, but I do. You know, when you have your change, I know people take their change and they save it. Of course, Galen does that. But whatever change I get, I care about that, y'all. I keep my change in my purse. And before, when I go to the self-checkout, before I put my dollars in, I add all my change. I don't care if I got a big handful of change. Now, if I got a lot of change, I take it to the change machine first. And then I get the cash from it. But if I got enough that I fit in one hand and there's nobody behind me, I sit and I feed all the change in first and see how it knocks me down okay so i've done that several times and say for instance um if it was like 68 dollars um by the time i fed my change in i was down to like 40 dollars and some change so that cut me down on my dollars that i had to spend so i like to do that um if i can um and i had a lot of quarters so you know those quarters and pennies do too but that's how I do sometimes. Expense. That's why I like to do the self-checkout because I could take my time if there's nobody behind me. And um, just go from there. So, just want to give y'all an idea of what we're eating for the next couple of days. Um, I'm going to go and 
Check on my baby. I thought I heard him coming. And, um, y'all, keep Papa Smurf in your prayers. Ashley had to take him back to the hospital again. Uh, he had 104 fever yesterday. And he, um, he has an ear infection. So, you know, with teething comes ear infections, sore throats, fever, diarrhea, all of that kind of stuff. So, he's going through the stages, y'all. And y'all just go ahead and put a prayer out for our little baby, okay? I love y'all. I thank y'all for your words of encouragement. Um, I'm pushing y'all. I'm pushing. I'm pushing through my feelings. <laughs> you get tired sometimes, y'all. Yes, you do. You do. You get tired sometimes. And I know God said don't get weary and well-doing. And I'm trying, y'all. So thank y'all. I love y'all. Don't forget, we got our live broadcast tonight at 8 o'clock on our other channel. Bye, guys.